Welcome back to another edition of Home Cook vs. Pro Cook, and today Chef Levon and I are going head to head in making Spanish tortilla. Now, on Instagram, Chef Levon posted a video on how he made the dish, and when I first watched it, I was kind of intimidated by it because there was a step where he would take a plate onto a pan and flip it over. And now I've never done that before, so we're gonna see how I'm gonna do it today. But on the bright side, there's not that many ingredients to work with. It's just potato, onions, and six eggs. But first, let's take a look at that video. All right, peeling it, slicing it, putting in water, slicing the onions. My knife work might be, uh, might need some work. Okay, potatoes first and then the onions. Looks like it's softened up. Six eggs in the big bowl. Potato is soft and mushy. Strain that. Taste test. Mix it with the eggs. And then it's the final product. This is where I get intimidated right here. Plate, flip, <laughs> back into the pan. Jiggle, jiggle, flip again, back into the pan yet again. Oh man. All right, now all of these go in here. Oops. So far, I think I have been doing okay. Not a bad start. I'm gonna have to drain this, pat it dry. While that dries, it looks like I'm gonna have to start heating up my oil. 300, it's time to add it in. In the meantime, time to make our egg mixture. See a little bit of browning. Oh no. Put it to low. Well, I found this thick piece right here and it's pretty mushy. So I feel like that's done. Taste test. All right, let's hit it with the olive oil. Medium heat, we're supposed to use the reserved oil. I gotta get some reserved oil. All right, when it's hot, we're gonna add the mixture. Lower heat, stir mixture at the bottom and on the sides to prevent from overcooking. I think this plate will do. Remove it from the heat. Oh. oh no, I spilled a lot. I was supposed to put more olive oil. Now there's still enough in there. You can see the mess here, but there's a bigger mess back here. I gotta clean that up. At least it stayed in one piece, which is really all I wanted. Flip over again and gently heat. All right. Oh, let's give it a good shape. Get rid of the bubbles. All right, this flip shouldn't be as bad. Let's try it. Kind of burnt. That was my last flip. <laughs> I 
Well, we'll see what the inside looks like. That is solid. <laughs> oh, it's hot. It's supposed to be runny in the middle, but I left it on for too long, mainly because I was scared of flipping the pan. And also, I was scrambling to get the plate, which I was gonna use to flip, so I should have prepared it beforehand. When I make this in the future, I'm definitely gonna have a plate next to me when I'm ready to flip. And also, now that I've done the flip, I feel like it will be easier the next time around because I know what to expect and I should get a plate with curves on it so that it doesn't spill out of it after flipping it. Because I made a mess earlier. <laughs> Well, that is it for me today in this video. Thank you so much for watching and sharing a space with me here at our virtual table. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and comment down below what you thought of this video. See y'all in the next one.